Hello once again there everybody, uh, coming back at you once again with some more castle story. Uh, last time we had played a little bit of survival and we tried it and I'd actually failed horribly at it because I couldn't figure out how the hell to get more little Bricktron friend, well I knew how to get Bricktrons, but I didn't know how to get the uh, warriors to properly, uh, you know, be here. Uh, now I think I started on hard for the last one and it, t it docks you like two minutes or something like that. Now, with this one on uh, normal, it gives me an extra little Bricktron to start off with. Okay, you go chop down that tree. So I'm going to have them chop down a couple quick trees here, get this going. I actually have figured out how to get that done properly, and I felt quite foolish for not realizing it earlier, and oh god, really? Can we not send all of the fucking things over the goddamn edge here, people? Oh god, I'm wasting time, wasting time, wasting time. Can't waste time in survival. Need to build, 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 build. Come on, go. Build. You, chop down another tree. Alright. So I'll keep chopping down all these trees. Then I'll have him assist with the building of this stuff. As I don't need much wood right now anyway, I'm going to build this thing purely out of... Uh, if I was building something fancy, I could use a lot of wood. But I'm good right now. Let's have him help that. Alright, so let's go build. Extra bit of wood here. Now, you need barrels to start off with. You need to have several little barrels here. Now, these can be either explosive or they can, uh, you know allow you to get more Bricktrons. Either way, they're mined out. Alright, can't edit that right now. Hopefully they'll have enough logs. Just barely, I think. So the moment they build it, I need to select it and make sure they aren't going to put the explosive stuff in it. Because that is the default. I, wish you, I really wish it was the other one. The other way around. Because I need a lot of the blue crystals, so I'm going to spawn in some good defenders. To help me in the evening. Alright, turn on the blue crystals. Alright. What are you doing? No, no, don't destroy it. Don't destroy it, you fool. There you go. So they're starting to place those in there. Let's have them keep chopping down these trees if they can. You were supposed to do that, my friend. Not anything else. Anyway, uh, I'll put you up front. Let's get a basic uh, structure going here pretty quickly. Now, I need a wide open area here because I need to be able to place... I need to be able to place down those barrels. So let me actually go like this. One more. There we go. That makes a nice wide open little castle for me. Now the only downside of doing this is, of course, I have to make that much more, or add that much more in to actually, there we go. Well, one way or another, I'll put the, I'll put the entrance on the right side. Okay. Alright, you boys, both of you, get over here. Start building. Alright. Place blocks. Now, let me kind of angle myself here a little bit better. Build half bricks. Alright. Put these guys on here. Let's get another full round of bricks here quickly. As quick as I can so we can get this thing over with. You shall not outpace me. Actually, doubt they could if I if they tried. Meh. Anyway, hopefully, I have enough time to spawn in at least two archers and an extra knight, just in case. All right. Now, I'm going to have to build some stairs here soon as well, so they can get up here. 
So with two guys making them and two guys hauling this, we have really decent combination for that. Okay, once I have this done, I'm going to start building the stairway up so they can actually reach this location. Now, I plan on building it like this instead so they have a good platform to stand on either side. And I'm also going to be building up and making like a nice little overhang here for building certain things. But anyway, let's get my stairs in place here, first thing. Now, where do I have more room? Looks like I have more room on the left side here, so I'll do that there. Alright. Build stairs. Actually, I don't really even need that last bit, do I? Nope, because that's more than enough to get them up there. Well, I could do a double stair if I wanted to, or one on each side. Anyway, let's deselect that for now. We're doing pretty good. Let's send him over to gather any of the ones that are ready. Send you over here, my friend. Okay, which one of these are ready? That's ready. So, it's like... Two of them are ready. Alright, my friend, if you can pick that up for me. I don't know if you can, but I'd appreciate it if you could. Doesn't look like you can. Alright, I'll send you over here then for a second. Since it's quite important that we get that done right now, I'll have you pick that up. And go ahead and send it over here, my friend. Drop that load. Alright, I'll just send you over here then. Okay. And you as well, you're gonna help. Because I need these done right now, like right now. So pick that up. And bring her over. Okay, now you need to place these lovely little barrels here full of the uh, magical essence of Bricktrons, as it were. Uh, right near the. Uh, oh, what are you doing here? Right near it, and then let me send him back to the mine here quickly. You. Oh, shit. Did not mean to do that. You get your butt back to work. For some reason, this guy is choosing not to drop the load. Alright, let's have the mine. So I'll have three of them. Actually, no, I'll have you build two. Okay. Once you have them here, you need to click on your right click on your crystal and then choose what kind of thing you want to build here. Use energy to create brick trons. Doesn't necessarily say how much it does. I can actually probably figure that out in info. But yeah, let's spawn in an archer and a another worker and send him to the mines. All right, and that used up. So generally, they use the same amount. They use ten per in order to get shit done. Alright, let's send that back over here. So that is now an empty barrel. I don't know what the hell they're doing. Oh, I see. No, I don't see. Why won't you drop that? Apparently he has no option to drop things. So I could pick it up, but I can't have him drop it. Well, that's good. I just wasted an archer. Nah. So shit, hopefully he'll drop that damn thing when I need him to. Shit, that's terrible. So note to self, never allow any of my archers and such to carry things. It does not work. Why are you guys glitching out? I hate it when that happens. There's no viable reason for them to flip out, but they are flipping out. But that's part of an alpha. That's part of being an alpha. It just happens. Like that. Oh great, they're starting to stop their work. Because they ran out of bricks. 
Because the other guys are not properly dropping it off for some damn reason. It could be because we don't have enough barrels, but no, the barrels... Let me try enabling that there, orange crystals. Maybe that will allow them to get it done properly. What is your major malfunction right now, dudes? Drop your load, boys. So yeah, it looks like it is the... It is the orange crystals that are causing me a bit of a hell right now. Alright, get in there, boys. You can go ahead and build another one. You don't help them with, help them with the mines for now. Everyone just go to the mines. Let's get as many of these things ready to go as we can and get them producing, because right now we're having that problem where they just... Oh my god, why won't not? I can't assign you to a task, so I'm hoping that when he gets into combat, he'll drop that. But more than likely, he's just a useless, uh, useless guy at this point, and I have no choice but to ditch him. All right, let's get building. Okay, get building. Okay, need you all to start building. We need to get that thing going like now. All right, do we have any more? Please tell me we have more. Yes, we do have one. We'll drop your load over there. I'm assuming it has crystals in it, so you can't use it. Yep, it's all orange crystals. That's why. Okay, you get in there. I need to spawn a new, uh, a new archer in, though, so let's get in here. Let's pick that up, pick up that barrel. Or you can pick up that, but I didn't want you to pick up. That works perfectly fine as well. Cough. Not really. Pick up the barrel. Alright, once they've built a uh, decent amount of this place, I'm going to put them back to work. You keep going back in there. Actually, you know what? Stop that. I want you to build this. Too late. He went inside. Alright. Let's get some barrels built here. I'll spread them out a bit, though, so that they don't have any problems with them. Alright, now let's go chop down some trees quickly and get that built. Come on, my friend. Okay, now. Where is that little bugger? Get inside, get inside. Okay, now get that building. Start getting those done. Drop it, thank you. Okay, now, send you back to the mines to work. So let's spawn in another archer if I can. Is it not close enough to the crystal? It may not be. Okay, we'll pick that up. We gotta put a drop it close to the crystal. Okay. And we'll let me spawn any archers. That's weird. Well, let's hope one of these gets some more power. Yes, it did. Okay. Get that back into the castle. Your 
blocking the guy that's the most important right now. Please don't. Okay, you go mine some more. We'll need more. God damn it, I can't spawn more, you guys. That's weird. It's refusing to allow me to spawn more. Oh, 67% ready to spawn. Oh, I see. So I have to wait a while or something? Well, that sucks. This guy's definitely gonna die because a cr uh, Bricktron cannot take on a Corruptron one on one. Wow, actually, he's doing a good job of it. I mean, I'm using the other guy here as a, uh... Kind of a block for them, in a sense, but shit, I really wish I could drop that shit he has on him. Let me try... Let me try enabling this debug mode. Because a combat unit, he cannot... Yeah, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Even with debug mode on, he cannot drop it. Sixty-seven percent ready to spawn. Maybe we just need more as we go along. I'm not really sure. Go chop down some more trees for me, my friend. All right, let's build a couple more barrels, specifically for, there we go, let me cancel that, specifically designed for the uh, blue crystals, I should say, cough. I'm just not, not using my brain tonight, man, not, not using my brain. All right, there you go, man, go have at her. There's another one that can be used for that. Make sure that's one. It should, when these things are actually full, it should like glow a color. That would be nice. Put ten in there. Oh well. Is there any other ones that are full? That one's ten full. So if I build a catapult, I'll definitely have a lot of ammunition for that at the very least. All right, my friend. Get to mining. All right. Oh great! And I got other people messaging me. Always people messaging me on here, I swear. Alright. Let's drop this crap over here. Fifty percent, negative fifty percent ready to spawn. So it seems like the more I put on here, that's really weird. Yeah, a lot of people still seem to not know that. <laughs> Ah, sometimes, sometimes. Jeez, so many interruptions. God. Anyway, I joke. Um, let's see. So I kind of want to do a double here. That way, I can expand this thing into a true. There we go. Oh, no, I can't do that there. Because the whole point of this last bit is that I do this. And I do need this here, though. There we go. And then likewise, on the last part of it here, 
I want to go like that. And that will allow me, it should allow me a stable enough platform. Actually, I might need to extend that a little bit further. friend please thank you that should allow for a catapult and ammunition to be stored up there so I'm gonna have both side excuse me both sides look exactly like that There we go, that'll look good like that. Beautiful. Alright, so that'll be more than good enough. Wave number two starts soon. Still haven't found that many. Grab that, my friend. Go ahead here and drop that off. So I have enough of this stuff near here, so... Man, I really wish they would give you more details about the intricacies of how this works, because I now have enough what should be enough for, like, four or five... Yeah, four of these little guys. But for some reason, maybe it's just that the crystal needs a lot of time to charge, but... Watch what happens when I drop this here. Because before I dropped down one or two, and I was able to make two. Now, when I look at it, it's like, okay, that didn't, oh, that didn't even affect it. Huh, weird. You know what, let me try bringing the other stuff there, too. You guys bring that over here. Maybe if I bring the orange energy crystals, which are supposed to be the explosives, uh, with me as well, that might make the difference. I really don't know at this point. I'm just kind of hoping. Do the thing you were going to do. Figure that's what you were going to do. In that case, let me have you do a bit, be a builder for now. To assist these guys. Alright. Let's see what happens when I drop the supposed explosive barrels in here with it. And then send you guys back to mine. It did no difference whatsoever. So maybe I have to wait for the day to spawn it. That's actually probably a possibility is that you can't spawn during the evening. Hmm. But still, that means I'm down to one guy, and that sucks. I only have one guy that'll be able to defend me. Two kills. So I got two kills on the enemy, and we got a minute left until I spawn. I have no idea when daylight could come back. Or it could be a daylight will never come back. Because it's an eternal night style situation where you survive as long as you can. In which case, if I can't spawn any more guys, I'm done anyway. <laughs> It's game over, man. Game over. But if this thing, if that is the truth of it, if this thing will actually spawn more units in the day, then I may be able to get shit done then. But until then... Let me build... Some catapults up here.
So when they actually get those walls built, I'll be able to get those catapults up there, get them armed. And we'll see what happens then. Okay. You guys help them build. Building is an absolute priority right now. Here comes the enemy. Oh, he's actually shooting. His archer is actually shooting. Even though the... Even though he's holding a barrel, he's shooting. Oh god, we're pretty fucked. Look at them, here they come. Wow, no way he survived that. I am sincerely surprised that he just survived that. 50%, negative 50% ready to spawn still. Ugh, that's annoying. At least this guy healed up, but we did lose our archer, so shit, what to do there? Do a new job here then. I'll sign you to cleaning. So have you collect all that stuff up. Still will not let me spawn any of you guys in. So yeah, that's the slight that's probably what they meant when they said that the survival is slightly bugged. Is that sometimes you just cannot build. Okay, I want them to get that done. At the very least, when we get our catapults up, we'll have some measure of defense. Okay, you, my friend... Well, it doesn't matter. You've already grabbed a, bla a brick, so you're useless to me now. I need somebody who has not grabbed a brick. Like this guy. Alright, my friend. I need you to... Well, let's grab that one and put it in here first. Because that one is my... Uh... Oh, there we go. It actually tells me, too. Orange crystal, 100%. Make this barrel explode. this container. Uh-huh. So like I'm trying to get some more detailed information from it, but it's just not it's just not letting me. It's not having it. Okay. So he's ready to drop that off here now. So let me put them in the corner here. I'll put all the explosive ones in the corner. Go pick that up, my good sir. Okay, Bilbo, go ahead and start mining again. You will need that. While I get this guy to move all the explosive barrels. Okay, once they once he has successfully moved all the explosive barrels. Then I will start building up a wall to assist in slowing down the enemy. Alright, so once I get that wall up, we should be a little bit better off. We'll be able to slow them down a little bit so that they can't just charge right in like they have been. And once they're trying to destroy the walls, I will launch the, uh, use the catapults to launch on them. Since I can't make any more, I might as well. Come on, let me spawn, you bastard. 43% ready to spawn. Oh, now it's in the po- now it's in the positives. So now it's in the positives. Don't know what that matters much, but we'll see. We'll find out.
All right, let's see here. So we have one more explosive one over there. Two explosive ones ready to go. So let's go grab that, my friend. Have you pick that up? So it could be that it just takes time, but in which case, what dictates how much time it takes and all that? Like, I don't know, man. I don't know. Right now, I'm still in a lot of trouble. Is it the amount of barrels I have with blue charges? That shouldn't make the difference. Alright, how much more you have left on this thing here, boys? God, you guys are slow. There's five of you working on it. That's the worst part. Okay. So I got one guy mining, doing his job. The rest are... Drop that load. Thank you, good sir. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Another explosive one. I believe there was another one. Yep, right there. This one has more life crystals on it, so let's grab that and drop it off in here. It could be that it's just the amount of life crystals we need. That's holding us back. I don't know, but that would be a lot of them to spawn a single guy. Honest, well, honestly, I could put all my guys into mine and just have them... Well, they can't... That's the thing. I can't specify, I don't think, to mine a specific thing. Oh, I can... There we go. I can have them not mine orange crystals and just mine blue crystals. That I can do. So that's something, at least. Forty-three percent ready to spawn. I don't know if that was after I dropped that thing off or not. Alright, my friend, go pick up the explosives. Let's get them all in place. They're slowly getting this done. It's just that they keep running all the way around each time. Well, it's kind of like a. Uh, just going like clockwork, man. Like clockwork. These guys. These guys. If I can't spawn another unit in, though, I'm going to be in some serious trouble. I honestly don't know what to do right now. I'm just like... Oh, I'm gonna get so killed when the chant when it, when the next wave comes in because they only have the one guy to defend me, and they're not working fast enough to get the catapults up in time. I don't think. I'll have you work on that crew too. Okay, let's get to work. I need all of you on that crew now, 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 now. We need that leveled area. We need to get those catapults up. We're not gonna survive this next wave. It's really weird though that I was able to spawn two of them right in the beginning and then suddenly it just would not. So there's definitely something up there. Because I should have been able to spawn in a little army by now. From each of these, I should have been able to spawn in at least one, I think. At this point, I want to spawn another warrior if I can. So I can't tell these guys to make any warriors either. That doesn't work. Hmm. That is a shame. That is a shame. Okay, we got a minute left, guys. A minute left before we're dead. Oh, I should have just put them all in building when I had enough blocks. Oh, well. It was nice knowing y'all. What I'm going to do, though, as a last-ditch effort of survival... For when they all... When all hell is breaking loose... Let's go place some bombs out in the battlefield here.
Okay. If I have to, I will detonate these. I really hope I don't have to, but I probably will. Alright, let's try detonating one a little bit farther away quickly. Quickly! Where are they coming from? We got one coming from this way. There we go. Oh, he survived, I think. Holy shit, he actually survived. How the hell do you survive that? Wow, buddy, you are one lucky, lucky bugger. Swear to God, that better have recharged us somewhat. Nope, 43% still. But you went the wrong way. Buddy, what are you doing? And he just murdered one! Dude, seriously! Get off your ass! Seriously, Crystal, stop screwing me right now, man! You're screwing me, Crystal! You're screwing me, buddy! What the deuce? And now all my guys are dead. Ah, yeah, this is definitely a little messed up right now. It should not... It should not be doing this like that. It's That's just not... That's not right. Yeah, no, this is, this is definitely bugged out at this point. Well, shit. That's a shame. That is a shame. Ah, what can you do? What can you do? Let me actually check something here if I can. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Yes, I know it's pinned. Let me drag this over here. Apologies for all the crap in the way. Alright, what am I looking for? Um... Not working, Bricktrons. No, that's not it. So there is no, there is nothing, absolutely nothing, to help me figure out. There we go, finally ready to spawn in some new ones. Thank God, we actually have some new ones now. Okay, you get to mining. You get to building. And you guys get to defending. So it's like, it is, it does seem to be like a charge. So there's a certain amount of time, so it's negative 25% ready to spawn. But the weird thing is it goes into the negative, which is... It's not supposed to do that. That's that's something that is definitely not supposed to happen. At least I have three defenders now. To kind of assist me here. All right. I can only block off the bottom and the left though. If I try and block off any more than that, it's going to it's not going to work that well for me. I can kind of force them down to one location though where my guys are fighting a nice narrow channel down here that might help. Although this is going to be difficult. I could probably block this off entirely, but I won't be able to This part will probably be open. Mm-hmm. I'll have to recall, recall, recrawl. Blah. 
recall all Bricktrons next time to make sure they don't get killed. Alright. There you go. Help me get that built, my friend, so we can get you guys working on uh, actually constructing the damn things and hopefully surviving. So, it's... Yeah, that's, that's really weird, though. Negative 25% rate of spawn. So, what dictates that? The amount of guys we kill, the amount that die? Uh, no answers, really. <laughs> no answers. So, at least I now have three warriors, which should be able to defend quite well against the hordes of enemies that are going to be descending upon me. There has to be a way to feed these to it or something, maybe. After he's done his job, I'm going to have him try and grab the barrel and maybe interact with the crystal with the barrel in his hands. That might do it. Because something is off with that. Blue crystals should allow you to spawn them, but last time what you would basically do was you would pick up the barrel, you'd place it near it, and you would get another Bricktron. Now it seems like they've significantly changed it in some way. Yeah, I can't drop it there or nothing. I can't really right click on this. All I can do is drop it right beside the thing, so there's no other way as far as I can tell to interact with it. So that should be what it's supposed to do, but yeah, it just may it just may be that it's slightly bugged as it were. So they'll probably fix that as it as they go along here. After all, they just now got onto Steam Early Access, so... And, of course, grats to them for that. It's nice to see they finally got that. You shouldn't even be collecting that. Weird. Anyway, let's have you help build. Let's get all this done here so while we have time. It's funny how they keep going from one section to the other section, though. Alright, keep on going, my little buddies. Keep on going. We got this. We got this. 19% ready to respond. Or negative 19%. So, I'm guessing it's supposed to go when you spawn a bunch of guys in using the crystals around it, it goes into a kind of a cooldown state. Uh, I'm assuming it's supposed to go to zero and then work its way back up to 100% over time, possibly absorbing the sunlight to do so. Because it's now sunny out. Because it's definitely going faster than it was. Maybe it's, maybe it's just it, at daylight it goes faster than it would at the night time. I'm honestly not really sure. And now he has his job to build this catapult. And I'll have the other guys start hauling ammunition up and loading it. I'll put him on as an operator at some point. Okay, once they get this bit done, that's it. That's all I needed them to do. So I'm going to recall my workers to the, uh, to the crystal to defend them. And then tomorrow I'm going to build some uh, just a too high wall that will stretch from the edge down to a location where I can continually bomb the enemy from this from these two catapults. I'm also gonna have to open up a passageway in the back here to let these guys in from the mine and then kind of like same thing slide them down to here so that they have to go they have to engage me here. So I'll have to remove these stockpiles, sal resalvage those, build them back here, get rid of these trees, build them back here. Build a back entrance, and that should help out significantly. 27 seconds till they come. Get 
Get ready, boys. Ten seconds. Oh, damn, son. Okay. You help that as well. Requires some interesting things to build this apparently, not just wood like I thought. Well, then you keep help building with them then. You help chop down trees here. What the hell are you doing? I want you to go over here and chop down a tree, not walk over the. fall off the face of the, uh. well. Call it a world. And I am starting to notice an increased amount of lag as we go along here. Hopefully that does not degenerate too much. Problems from that. Come on, get it done. All right. You get back to the mine. Let's check on the stats of the crystal here. Six percent ready to spawn. Man, ah, we're gonna be waiting a long. Long time before we can spawn in some more guys. Oh, the archers seem to be doing a really good job holding off the enemy. So I have one little guy on each and every job right now so far. So, so far he's put in like four blocks and I think one thing of wood. So, it probably needs a combination of the blocks and the wood to build the catapults, it seems. Okay, we got this, we got this. Really? I guess. I thought so. You shouldn't be harvesting that man. Literally, you should not be harvesting that. I specifically designated that mine not to do that. Apparently it's deciding to disobey me. Oh well, not much I can do about that, sadly. Wave 5 starts in 6 minutes! But now that I know how to spawn these guys in and how much time it takes, I might be able to survive this a lot easier next time by just spawning in military units and keeping the original guys as are. Like keeping them alive basically and not letting them die. Are you still not done yet, dear lord? What does it take to build a catapult these days? We could build a door here, but one of the thing one of the interesting things is that uh these little guys tend to have issues with doors, so until this thing is completely constructed, I don't want to build that door there, just in case. Because I really don't want them to. I don't want, I don't want them to screw that up. Kind of looks like we have an entranceway here, but it's just boarded up. There we go. It's finally built. Huh? 
You go help him build that. Help him finish this off, and I'll have both of you build the catap the second catapult. And there you go. See, we can just aim this thing practically where we want to. It's got quite a distance to it, apparently, that I can go. Holy crap, if it can reach all the way across the map, that's going to be pretty damn good. Well, it's nice to see that it actually shows that it's blocked by uh, something. Alright, beautiful. So we got two more blocks left to complete this structure. And then I can send them to uh, finish up the second catapult. I'm not sure where you plan to build that. Probably not going to, actually. But, well, I'll give you a purpose. There you go. I have given you purpose. Now go and strike fear into my enemies. Little critter fear or something along those lines. Anyway, let's check the percentage. 31% ready to spawn critters. Critters. Nice. Alright, so once I'm ready to spawn, I'm going to start moving all these stockpiles. Actually, no, I'm going to remove all those stockpiles now, I think. Well, first I'll have them empty the stockpiles, then I'll have them move it. Alright, new building task. Let's get this place firmly locked off, shall we? There we go. Nice. Oh, I'm getting there. Slowly getting there. So I'm going to kind of just board that area off like so. That's what I'm going to do here. You, my friend, get to work. Go have at her, buddy. Have at her. And I can have the other two arm the well arm. There's nothing basically constructed now. In that case you can go assist him. Hey Bilbo. Assign the operator. Okay, let me remove this for a second here. Delete the task. Okay. I want you to go pick up the ammunition, put it in place, and get ready to launch, my little friend. Drop into that. We have 30 seconds, let's get ready. Sign as operator. Okay, you will be you will be controlling that, my little buddy. How much time? 31%. Alright, let's get ready.
Let's see where my enemies are at. Fire! Perfect! Boom! Nailed him! Kind of. I think I actually missed because they're rolling through the ground right now. Whoa, what the fuck? He's rolling all the way to the crystal. Wow, what the hell? Clearly these guys have no idea what the hell they're doing because they're not doing their job. Run! Run outside, not that way. Fucking idiot. Why do I have to work with idiots? I... Could you do me a favor now and actually fight? Oh lordy. There we go. Thank you! Thank you for finally, finally growing a pair. Now go build that. See, we got pretty boned there, to say the least. Should not have gotten in that easily. Matter of fact, Bilbo, give me a second, my friend. I'm gonna have you build a door here. Get it done, my friend. It's like, with what? There's no wood around here? <laughs> we have a couple logs, luckily. They can't even reach that, then that's a good thing. That means it's blocked off properly. So, next thing I get the chance, I'm spawning in a whole lot of archers, and we're just gonna... There we go. She was only able to spawn in two. System, my friend. Okay, now. I'm supposed to be able to lock it, lock the door, but I don't think I can. Well, it's not myself. They they have to punch through the door in order to get through to the crystal and such, which will be nice, because then these guys won't be able to get in there as easily. And I can easily put one of these guys just sitting in there, right beside the door, to stop them from approaching it, just rushing through like this. Or that one guy. The major problem with some of these guys was that they just literally slid through the bloody ground and attacked. Okay, 23% ready to spawn, additional troops. I still have a whole lot of crystals here, so it's not, not that it's not a glitch right there as well. It's not actually taking any blue crystals to do this. Like, to spawn additional units, it should be using up blue crystals, but so far it has not done so. Well, it did originally, I think. I'm pretty sure that they were used up. It's just that now, for some reason, it's not. Converts rock into stone blocks.
Hmm, I want to be able to remove those stockpiles. Cancel, please. I'm gonna have to literally select this guy. Whoa, lag is definitely increasing for some reason. There we go. That's how I do it. I have to select my little dude and have him recycle it. Please do recycle that. Thank you. Sad part is we almost had enough to complete this wall here. Actually, we did complete the wall. Nice. All right, you can go build that now. Same thing for you, Bilbo. Go start harvesting. So there's no point in me making any more barrels at this point, except for if I'm going to make any, you know, the explosive variety. That's about it. Please go chop down this tree so I can make more barrels of the explosive variety. For when the last ditch efforts are when everything is in vain and all is lost, I will detonate that crystal. Our enemies, well technically that's what they want, but still. They shall, they shall die in hellfire along with my crystal, which they kind of already do since the crystal. You know what? Screw it. I'm not putting any bombs into the crystal. Or any other crystal. They already die in enough hellfire as it is. I don't need to, I don't need to exaggerate it anymore. What the hell are you doing? Oh, I know exactly what you're doing. Yeah, that's what you're doing. Oh, I thought so. Alright, let's have you build a bunch more barrels so you can get some explosives. Use your explosives, since you really want to. There you go, my friend. Go ahead. Go right ahead and have at her. Build to your heart's content. And after you've done that... After you've done that, let's get some more stockpiles up back here. Looks like they used up all the. In that case, my little buddy. Rather than running off all the way over there, I'm gonna have you chop down these trees here. So now he's going all the way up top to try and place this little block right there. If he fails, then I can always get him just to build the other side. Wait, what the hell? Where the hell are you going? Oh, I see. You're still building that? I did not expect you to actually do that. Hmm, you surprised me, little rascals. That works for me, though. That works for me. Oh, 30 seconds. Time I can spawn in more archers. Nope, forty-eight percent ready. There you go. Here they come. You get inside. The 
Defend your position. Okay, you go back to mining, you go back to that, and you go back to building. Wow, we got quite a few little souls around here now, don't we? Wow, they are just hovering. So my archers did a really fabulous job here, it looks like, at lessening the enemy threat. If you get back to work, not to go sit on the ledge, you fool. You bloody fool. What you thinking, lad? You can't be slacking off like that. Alright, Bilbo, my friend. I'm gonna have you be a quick little lumberjack here. Please do go chop those down for me. Ah, oh, wow! Doesn't that doesn't that just glow beautifully though? Look at that thing. Look at that damn nice thing there. Wow. That looks good. Now it's actually supposed to be pitch black at night here, honestly. So that you can't just, uh, that's what I'm looking for. So you can't see quite where the enemies are, that gives you a reason to build the torches. We still haven't built that entirely? No, no, I guess not, I still have to add one more block on that. And then it's done. The wall, this outer wall is done. What's the percentage? New ready to, ready to spawn. I'm gonna have to spawn two more archers. Beautiful. Alright. Good job. Now I need more. Next time I need more workers though. Buddy, stop right there for a second. Ba bing ba, go ahead and build. Do 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 do. Weird. I gave him a new job, and he's still kind of doing the old job. Ba -bing, ba -bing, ba -bing. Instead of chopping down trees, he went to go retrieve. logs, which is not what I want him to do. I want him to chop down trees. That's all I want, man. Is that is that such a difficult request? I don't think so. I don't think so, man. Alright, it's probably going to fall off the edge, but... Yep, they all fell off the edge. Alright. Crap, two of them fell off. Okay, chop it, Bilbo. Get chopping, my friend. So you can kind of shove it while you're doing it if you need to try and knock it away from the edge. No, oh, it failed. I got one. But for the most part was not a success. 
So I have maybe getting close to enough to finish up that thing, but that's about it. Fuck. Oh well. I tried, I tried. So he's gonna go up there and he should hopefully try and build that thing. I hope he succeeds. If he does, we'll be much better off. Good, he did. Alright, now this next part is going to suck for you, my friend. Because the amount that's got to go in it. Wait, am I building arches? God damn it. Silver, you fool. You bloody fool. Apparently, the arches I can't delete. It's mildly annoying. Alright. This was the intended building. Well, block to build. Getting there. Come on. Okay. All right, let's have him get to work on that. Get to build, my friend. We need to get that defensive wall in place. Once that's well, that one, that this initial wall will not do anything against them. It will just annoy them slightly. They'll just walk right over it. I have to get this last bit right here built. That's what will stop them and force them into my corridor of death. I shall rename it the corridor of death, for it shall be a long corridor at the end, or in the end, and many, many of my corrupt Tron enemies will die in it. There's actually going to be an. In they have an interesting uh, way about the uh, about how they did the what's it called? Oh man, um, the donate one. I should call it donators. It's not really donators, but here let me go like this as well. For those that pledge, basically the backers, they have an interesting way of how they're going to uh, show off. You know who was backer, who was a backer. There we go, with two of them. With all three of these guys running on, they should get a good portion of that wall done really quickly. They won't finish it, likely, but they'll at least get a good portion of it finished. Okay, the enemies are coming. What is the spawn rate? Negative 19% currently, so we still have a long time to wait. Okay, let's get you in there. Defend your position. Good, they did a good job. Oh, we got more coming from the right, more coming from the right. 
Oh, they went right over that. Of course, it's that's the way it is right now. Oh no! I thought he killed one. But I don't think he did actually. Actually, all of you get to mining for now. Mine up enough that we will not need that we'll be able to get this thing done in a single go. Now, look at all those souls we have around there. Still, the souls don't seem to affect exactly how long it takes for this thing to, you know, regenerate. It's just something. Well, I don't even have an explanation for it. Honestly speaking, I got nothing for you, man. I got nothing for you here. Ooh, that music. I love it. Oh, it's just great music. Doo -doo -doo -doo. They did a great job on that. Whoever they're, uh, I can't remember. I used to know by name all the different developers for this game, but I've completely forgotten it at this point. Uh, most of them. But man, they did a great job choosing their uh, music producer. Alright, keep it going, my friends. Alright, so this has actually been lasting quite a while here. Let me see. Oh, Jesus, it's been lasting really that long? God damn. We've been able to survive in the survival here for a long time. Of course, this is normal difficulty, and uh, if I was working on hard, I'd probably be getting even more boned, but yeah. There definitely needs to be some minor fixes, though, when it comes to spawning these guys more more of a description on why or how it works and so on and so forth because it should have been using up the blue to spawn them and it should have been uh, you know going to zero percent then working its way up to a hundred percent maybe even have a timer on it rather than a percentage I would actually say on the recharge oh uh, even if the factor even if night is a factor on that you could uh, just change the timer to be slowed by night like, say it's on 10 minutes and night falls, just put it up to 14 minutes saying night. And likewise, if it gets down to 4 minutes and daytime pops up, it's done. Kind of thing. It drops those 4 minutes. That would actually be quite a nice way to do it, I would say. That's my own opinion. Get her built, boys. Get her built. Alright, so we got a nice little fabulous uh, defensive area here. Once these walls get thrown up, we shall be not too bad. Not too bad. You know what, actually? Let me not... Let me select this thing here. Where is it? Let's just build some stairs. There we go. And that solves our problem of not being able to access this area. Once they build that stairway, then they can stay back here for that. They don't need to get out of here and be like, Oh God, we're trapped or nothing. No, once they've built this stairway, we're fine. They'll be able to get back up on this wall and we'll be done. Problem solved, man. Problem solved. Solving the problems, man. Solving the problems. And problem solved. Okay, once they build this... I'm going to have you go back to mining. Oh. 
Good on you, mate. Likewise for you. Well, no, I'll let you finish. What's the percentage at? 81% ready to spawn. Nice. So this next one, I'm going to spawn in at least at least one more regular Brictron. And then I'm going to uh, get another archer up on this wall here. And I'm actually going to put a platform over here in a minute, if I can. Mr. Baggins. Let me get you open over here, my friend. Alright, let's have you guys. Let's have you guys lumberjack a bit. There you go. Because I need a little bit of lumber in order to build what I'm planning on building here. Of course, as always, I'm going to prioritize when the spawning happens. 81% still. I'm going to prioritize spawning another archer in. And then I'm going to work on a brick tron just in case so I can only spawn in one. So we have the entire back section here is now cut off. So the only way they have to attack us is from the center here. And uh, when I get the chance, I'm going to be eliminating these trees here. Kind of letting them have a nice little path. And I'm gonna have a, I'm gonna extend this corridor a little wider, so that they have to come th straight down here, and I can choke it full of arrows and uh, our guys. It won't be that; it'll only be a two brick high, so it won't be something that we should block our archers. And I'll also put a new platform out front here, that should help them shoot down the center. There we go. Spawn an archer. Spawn a worker. And that's it. Where's my worker? There he is. Alright. Now, build. There we go. With that, it should be fine. I'll let him get that done. Go build that if you can, my friend. Mr. Baggins! Get your butt to work, damn it! So yeah, I plan on archers are just really, really powerful. It seems like now there were, there was a larger version of the Creptron that they had originally, but I think they removed it because it didn't quite. They didn't. They didn't feel like it felt like it worked as well as they had thought it would at the time, or it could have just been it was a temporary Victron they made in that sense. But it, they kind of removed him. But it's too bad because a bigger, slower that can take a you know Victron or Creptron that can actually take a few shots from the archers might work out pretty well. Of course, you would probably also get blown away. You know what? Instead of that, my friend, let me... You're my new guy. Let me have you just cut down some trees. Because the other guy is not doing it. They, they, what, That's a bit of a problem for me. They cut down one tree and then they haul all the logs away. And then they cut down another tree and haul all the logs away. And it's terribly inefficient at times. make a nice little shelf for them to chill out in. So 
And now they're kind of like, oh, now they got this like direct approach they have to do. Which puts them in perfect line for my archers. We'll see how many of these guys even make it. But we have a lot coming. We do have a lot coming. That's the one thing. So I'm sure several of them are going to make it in here. Oh, they made it to the last defender. But most of them got slaughtered. So it looks like our current... Our current strategy is working very, very well. So I'll kind of keep this guy on the edge here. Alright, we did good, we did good. They got annihilated there. What's the timer on? Negative 86%. God damn, that's going to be a long, long time. Last time that happened, it took like 15, 30 minutes to get it back. So we're probably not, that's probably not going to happen anytime soon. All right. It's a nice little place to post the archers on that side. So, let's get Let's get our corridor of death going, shall we? There we go. Nice. So from that... I'm going to extend this a little bit right here. I kind of want to remove this and put another... But instead of that, I'm going to... Simply... Do I want to just fill in the gaps or I want to build? Yeah, let's build like this. Nice little front edge there for them to battle on as well. That should keep them busy for a while. Hmm. The only thing I'm worried about here is not allowing the enemy to enter in the area. Better give them a uh, better make them a bridge. If the enemy can't get to us, then they're going to probably start bashing down the walls. And that is not acceptable. So I'm going to level out the area there a little bit, giving them a nice clear entrance way. So you guys are needed in the center now. You I'm going to put over here. If I can eventually make more, I will set more up there like that.
So I knew that would have problems. That's what happens when you only have one entrance. passed off to no they managed to pass each other okay so let's get down here I'm gonna drop this bit drop your load and join the uh, Joyce join, join the Mason's Guild as it were let me just spin myself around you'll spin me round 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 no, anyway now what we got here so five percent ready yay we've gone up eighty percent yay now it's nice that they've only managed to kill one of us we currently have 12, or have had, t yeah, no, we currently have 12, and uh, we've killed 73 of them, so that's pretty damn good. So on normal, normal really gives you a good chance. If I was on hard, I probably would have gotten annihilated by now. Easily, easily annihilated with the amount, with all the regening I have to do on this thing and such. Oh yeah, I probably would have, probably would have gotten majorly boned by now. You know what? To deal with some of our slight pathing issues that we've been having. So build another stairway right there. And likewise. Come on. I do not want to select any of you right now. So now they have two ways up. If they're going to pull stuff from over here, they can run up the right side. If they want to pull stuff from the left, they can run up the left side. Nice. We still have somebody mining? Weird. And it's interesting, the mine doesn't appear to have any limits to it. As far as I can tell. Good, they're building the top part here first. Well, sort of. They're building everything first. That's the thing. They're a little disorganized with how they decide to build things in what order and all that kind of thing. It's like sometimes they'll build the bottom one, other times they'll just kind of build half of it along the way. If you, if you put a lot of construction out there, they will have a little bit of issues. Let's check the timer here 20%. But at least now they can build with in relative peace, since all of the uh, all of the outer issues where they were you know getting attacked by the enemy has now been dealt with a little bit. However, I can see an issue here as well. We've just created a way for the enemy to get up to my archers easily. Crap! I just now realized that. I really hope they finish this stuff up right now. Or at least this wall, I hope they finish up really quickly, because if they don't, they basically allowed a direct route up to my archers. Yeah, that might be bad. I'm gonna get this guy up on the wall here, just in case. Wow, 
Wow, there's ten left. Ten enemies left. Fight! I still haven't managed to kill one of my little guys. It's a good thing. Okay, we've done good. We've done good. All our little dudes have survived. We have taken out the enemy. And we're generally doing a pretty good job. Check the timer. Still 20%. So yeah, they definitely should add it, add it in as a timed thing. Even put it up in the corner here as well, where units can spawn and how many it will allow or something. That way you can strategize more with the uh, mount, like which, which kind of troops you want, and so on and so forth. Oh hey, they destroyed the second bit here. That'll be useful for me. I now have access for more archers. But yeah, archers are definitely OP. They are dealing massive amount of damage to the enemies. There's a new job for you. Start collecting all the crap around here. And then deposit at home. There we go. Beautiful. We're doing a good job here. We're doing a damn good job here. So once they get this whole little mini bridge here built, I guess you can almost call it, then the enemies will be getting a much more smooth approach to the fortress, which allows me, my archers, to line up their shots better. They don't have to compensate for it nearly as much. So that's pretty, that's pretty nice, actually. Let me darken it a little bit more. There we go, that's perfect. I actually see it slightly brighter than that, but that's good enough. Close enough to perfection. Well, that's why, because I haven't built the lower part yet. So they have to build that, and then they can build the top. I'm sure they'll get around to it. There's a lot of there's a lot of for them to do right now. Definitely would like more Bricktrons right now, more miners and such. But 86% uh, ready to spawn. We'll be getting, we'll be, should be spawning here soon. Cause it's like it just jumps percents randomly for some reason. It doesn't just tell you, okay, it's 82%, 83%, 84%. No, just 80%, 20%, 10%, negative 85%. Hey, and always see, it always seems like the same numbers. So it's kind of awkward like that. All right. You, my friend, join the building crew. You know what? No, no. Join the mining crew for now. We need more building blocks. You can get up on this... Well, this section of the wall right now. For now. Beautiful. So we have a lot of archers. We've killed 91 enemies so far. We've done a great job here. But I've been at this for about an hour and 40 now, so I think I'm going to call this right now. And I'll maybe do another episode on this later when it's a little bit less of a, uh, you know, less insanity going on. Make it a shorter video. Alright, so this should be good. They'll be continue building, they'll continue getting everything done. Hopefully the save and load will work. I suppose I could actually check that. Okay, save. Yes, alright. I like how they've definitely improved a lot of their UI. Like, their UI used to be pretty pretty difficult to manage, to say the least. Okay, leave the game. Return to the title screen. Let's make sure that it'll actually work. Load, survival. Everyone should be doing all their jobs. Make sure that it's working properly. They're all assigned, that the jobs are all still uh, set up properly. Just as a last little thing for this here. So yeah, if you guys have not picked this up, picked up this game yet, it is available now on Steam Early Access. So definitely check it out. Uh, give it a go, and uh, hopefully you guys will enjoy it as much as I do. I love this little game. Especially the sandbox part. You actually, you should see some of the crazy shit some people have made in the sandbox. Like, I, I can't even, I look at that and I'm like, what? How the hell did you build something so crazy? But yeah, anyway, 
Anyway, loading. Loading. That seems to be the one issue here, is it takes a long time to load it. So whether or not it does load it or it doesn't, I'm not going to subject you guys to any more of this loading screen. So thank you very much for watching, guys. Have yourselves a good one, and I'll catch you all next time for some more uh, Castle Story. Peace out.